there. Thanks for joining me. This is Lynn Allen with a tip that I'm afraid I'm not going to post for Catalyst because <laughs> it's not really appropriate. In fact, this tip is pretty much every CAD manager's nightmare. So I apologize to all you CAD managers out there ahead of time, all right? Because I'm going to show you how to download the Hangman app so you can play Hangman inside of AutoCAD. Yay! <laughs> all right, now, of course, you will not do this while you're working, not while you're trying to get projects out the door. You will only do this during your break. Only play Hangman during your break or at lunch or after work, okay? <laughs> or at home. All right, but I'm going to show you. I was pretty excited when I found it. All right, so this works for AutoCAD 2012 or 2013. Sorry about the guys before that. Uh, upper right hand corner of the screen will take you to the Autodesk Exchange, that big X. All right, so you click on the X. Easy enough. And this will take you to the AutoCAD, the Autodesk Exchange. Right now I'm looking at the app specific to AutoCAD and you'll find all types of great apps that can make you be more productive at work. Much better apps than Hangman. <laughs> but today I'm going to be bad and we're going to go find Hangman. So you're just going to type in Hangman and it will find it. There's only one. And then all you have to do is download it. It's absolutely free. A lot of the apps actually on the Autodesk Exchange are free. This one, of course, is free. And then it'll ask you to install it. And then when you're done installing it, I've already done that, so I can't show you that part. You'll go back into AutoCAD. And I'm assuming you're using the ribbon. Hopefully you're using the ribbon. And you're going to go to Plugins. All right, let's take a look at Hangman. So it gives you some basic information, including important bits of information on how to quickly exit in case your boss walks by. <laughs> okay, you didn't learn any of this from me. All right, so the way you can get out of it is uh, by just picking outside of the Hangman, just by typing in any character or right clicking. So you can quickly exit, nobody needs to know. All right, well, let's play a game. I'm gonna say, okay. All right, so you can see uh, a, a little spaces so you know how many characters are in the word, just like Hangman, we all know Hangman. And let's see, and I don't know what the word is, so I'm the same but with you. And you click on the letter. It's a little hard to see the cursor, I, I won't lie. So I'm gonna go ahead and say uh, A. Ah, I was totally lucky, wasn't I? Uh, R, R is a popular word, letter, right? No, uh oh, that wasn't good. How about S? Oh, no. How about T? Yay. Oh, attack? Attach? Oh, well, no, there's a C, I bet, right? C? Okay, I'm going to make some other errors just so you can see the hangman build. We'll pick a Q. There's no Q in there. We'll pick a Z. There's no Z in there, right? All right. So, uh, just so you can see, it continues to build. We'll do one more. So you get the legs and then you're out. After the legs, you're done. All right, but I'm pretty sure it's attach. So, I'm going to say. Uh, oh, it wasn't. It's attack. <laughs> you won. Want to play again? You look around and see if your boss is around. <laughs> if he's not, absolutely. <laughs> so, now, how do you get out of it really quickly? Remember, just pick out of it, right click, or type any character. So, you should be able to exit very, very quickly. You did not learn it from me, but how cool is that? Yay, Hangman and AutoCAD. Now, some of you veterans remember in the old days, there was a Lisperty that did Hangman in, Auto, in AutoCAD too. <laughs> this is a little bit better than the Lisperty was back when. But anyway, thank you for joining me. You didn't learn this tip from me. <laughs> Have a great rest of the day.